Great clip. There's my low to medium budget urban cruiser setup. So I've taken a $350 bike from Dick's Sporting Goods. This is a Diamondback Axis, and most of that money is for the frame. So it's a really good aluminum frame, but the components were kind of crap. So here's what I've done to it. On the front, I put a RockSox Recon Silver Air fork on it. So it's got air adjustability. It's got a lockout on it so I can I can both set the compression and the rebound lock it out if I'm climbing and then change the air in it to give it more or less spring pressure so it's pretty universally adjustable and also very comfortable on the street when I want it to be or very firm if I want to climb up a hill I uh, got the old lizard skin chain slap stopper because this was clang clang clanging when I was riding in the mountains though I don't do that on this bike anymore we got the fix slick from WTB so this is a slick road tire you can see no tread on it um, you can run it up to 65 pounds of pressure so it can do two things if you want comfort with that hardtail on the street and you've got a lot of potholes you can run it at 30 pounds and if you want to go fast you can crank it up to 65. Uh, i've got a little bag here in the back full of tools and a tire pump and then these i got these a pair of these on ebay for i think 11 dollars with free shipping so we got Front light, a little red light in the back. So safety is number one priority on this bike. And then I put a bottle cage on it and love these pedals. Got these off of one of my son's BMX bikes that he didn't want, 50-50 pedals, and they are smooth. Pedals make a big difference, especially the crap plastic pedals that come with most bikes in this price range. It's worth it to swap them out for something that just rolls smooth. And the total weight is 30.8 pounds. So it's not light, but it's not really a road bike either. And we've got eight speeds in the back, a little crash damage there, and three speeds in the front. And mechanical disc brakes on it. They're low level, cheap mechanical disc brakes, but they really work great. So uh, I'm happy with those too. They stop it just fine. 